had planned originally when they had set up that we were going to travel back and forth every day. And unfortunately for my husband, the first day he came for his first treatment, they had to do a biopsy and his lung collapsed. So he ended up in the hospital and um, they offered me a room. So I said, well, that's very nice. And then where he was having chemo on Thursday mornings, I said, you know, would it be possible to get a room over there on Wednesday nights because his chemo is so early. By that time, I don't know who, the doctors, whomever, had already let the social services people know my husband's situation. She said, here is a key, it's yours for five weeks. If you need it longer, you let us know. You walk in here and I mean, I really didn't have anything with me to stay overnight, but they provide everything. I mean, there is shampoos, deodorants, towels, whatever you need. Uh, and it's very comfortable, and my husband has actually enjoyed it, so we do not travel back and forth. We come down on Monday afternoons, and we go home on Fridays after his last radiation. And it's just unbelievable it's so comforting and it truly is like your own home it just provides so much it I can't even explain it's really a godsend you know it takes the pressure off you feel relaxed um, and people exchange their stories so you find out well maybe you're not the only one that's got a few issues going on but everything they provide, I mean, it, it's even, it's like I said to Jerry, the washers and dryers and the, the laundry detergent. I mean, the books, uh, the puzzles, the kitchen, and the whole atmosphere is just like being home. It truly is. The room that we have is wonderful. Um, the beds are very comfortable. We have two recliners in our room. Uh, sink, great bathroom. I mean, there's nothing that you can want for, truly.